What's going on guys? This is Paleo Peachy and today we're reviewing the Schleich 2018 Dyna Gorgon. Dyna Gorgon, which means terrible Gorgon, named after the Greek monsters that turned people to stone, was a genus of Gorgonopsid that lived in South Africa and Tanzania during the late Permian. It was discovered by Robert Broom in 1936 and it grew up to 6.6 .6 feet in length. Now, if you couldn't tell by that description, there's not much known about this animal right here. Um, so all the reconstructions and stuff, I believe they went off of just like one jawbone. Uh, I believe it was the maxilla or something. Um, I'm not too sure. It had to do with the head. Um, but yeah, so everything else on the body of this creature was inferred from other Gorgonopsis like Inostrancevia. Um, but anyway, Schleich did an amazing job with this figure. They really capture that mammal-like reptile feel. It looks like a lizard, but like a wolf too, you know? It looks really, really great. Now, if we look up here at the head, Schleich captures this amazing, iconic Gorgonopsid uh, look. They have these large canines and other, you know, sizes of teeth, and that iconic Gorgonopsid shape. It looks really amazing, in my opinion, and I just love that. Um, now, there aren't that many scales on this figure, obviously, because they were more related to mammals than reptiles, actually. Um, uh, but there is some scales up here by the lips, but, you know, the rest is all these wrinkles and muscles, and that looks amazing. You can see, like, the ribs, all the muscles. It is a bit shrink-wrapped, I guess, um, but it still looks really cool. They have the veins and all that, and it just looks amazing, in my opinion. They have some scales down by the, uh, the toes and the arms and legs, which looks really cool. But, yeah, overall, this looks great. I love these stripes down the back, too. This, in my opinion, looks so, so cool, and I definitely recommend it. So, in my opinion, I give this rating a 10 out of 10. Schleich did an amazing job with this figure, even though not much is known about it, and I really love how they did that. So, yeah, 10 out of 10. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you want your own own Dynagorgon. I will link that down in the description. And um, once again, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!